Congratulations to the class of 2021. Hello, I'm Chris Long, Dean of the College of Arts and Letters at Michigan State University. Normally, I would be staring out over a sea of caps and gowns, the rafters filled to capacity with family, friends, and loved ones to support each of you, the brilliant and resilient class of 2021. Instead, I'm coming to you on video from my living room. I can assure you though, the distance between us this past year due to the pandemic does not diminish the joy of this celebration or the significance of your accomplishment. We are so proud to celebrate the graduation of you. Your College of Arts and Letters degree at Michigan State University draws upon the power of varied viewpoints and diverse backgrounds. Your experiences have provided you with the capacity to think critically, imagine creatively, and respond ethically to the most challenging social and cultural questions we face. Your education in the College of Arts and Letters has empowered you to be conscientious and engage citizen leaders who are capable of working collaboratively with local, national, and global organizations. Your degrees have been enhanced by the study and practice of written and artistic expression from diverse traditions and interdisciplinary courses. So you are prepared to live in multiple worlds and you are capable of imagining how to enrich lives and relationships in a wide variety of different contexts. For generations, our alumni from the College of Arts and Letters at Michigan State University have transformed lives through engaged leadership and helping others along the way. And I know you will do the same, but you must put the values that have shaped your education into practice. Only through intentional practice Will your passion, leadership, and talent mobilize the power of an MSU, liberal arts education, to create a more just and beautiful world? On behalf of the faculty and staff of the College of Arts and Letters, I wish you the best as you pursue the individual goals you each have for your lives, your families, and your communities. But we hope, too, that as you embark upon this new journey, you will remember how your experience here on the banks of the Red Cedar has shaped the person you have become and that you will return often and mentor and support the next generation of students in the same spirit in which those who came before you provided support and encouragement that you needed to arrive at this exciting moment of commencement. And now I would like to introduce MSU College of Arts and Letters Associate Dean of Research and Graduate Education, Bill Hart Davidson. Thank you, Dean Long. To all of our spring 2021 advanced degree graduates in the College of Arts and Letters, I want to offer my heartfelt congratulations and admiration for your hard work and your amazing achievements. Your arrival at this new beginning the commencement of the next phase of your lives and careers has required perseverance beyond what any of us imagined would be necessary when we first welcomed you to Michigan State University to begin your degrees. You are now masters of arts, masters of fine arts, and doctors of philosophy. You are also authors of unique and fascinating epic tales of how you have come to earn these prestigious titles. There is no doubt that the experiences we have all had in the last year will leave us changed people. It is important to pause and recognize the conditions for which the name of the calendar year, 2020, will serve as a convenient shorthand for some time to come. The COVID-19 global pandemic brought rapid change and disruption to the rhythms of our academic and indeed our everyday lives a growing movement to reckon with past injustice and confront anti-Black and anti-Asian racism has shifted social and institutional priorities. Economic impacts from a turbulent global economy have widened disparity and at the same time made structural inequity impossible to ignore. 
and the accelerating effects of global climate change continue to pose greater tests of our infrastructure and resilience, as well as our resolve to address this generational challenge. I acknowledge the co-presence of these conditions and the struggles they represent in this otherwise celebratory moment to say that we, your colleagues, your friends and families, your neighbors, your coworkers, your fellow human beings are ready for your contributions. We are eager for you to take up anew the creative work of addressing these challenges. And we are ready to invest our trust and our own energy in your success. That's what we mean when as mentors and colleagues and parents, we say, we are proud of you. We mean we know all that you have endured has prepared you to have a positive transformational influence on the world around you. Graduate students in the College of Arts and Letters are prepared to be transformative individuals, artists and scholars that bring knowledge, experience and passion to the job of making a better world. Transformative scholars and artists hold institutions to account while leading progressive change to make them more inclusive, more transparent, capacious, and reciprocal places. They measure their own career success by those beyond themselves and how they benefit from their work. They change things for the better and they leave things better than they found them. You all have this potential to lead transformative change within you. We recognized it when we invited you to join the Spartan community. Having completed your degrees, you've now had a chance to learn, to ask questions, and to practice, to change that potential into kinetic energy. Along the way, you've inspired others, shared your knowledge, and created durable collegial relationships. I think you'll find that those relationships are among the most important and valuable things you've cultivated during your time at MSU. Because while each of you is an impressive and capable individual, what you can accomplish working together is nothing less than world changing. We expect great things, but don't worry. Many of us here at MSU are working towards those ends too. These are goals we all share. So know that as you go forward, you need not go alone. Remember the power of working together with others. Remember as your time comes to lead, that being a good leader means investing in the success of those around you as your mentors have invested in you. And remember that we will always be here for you when you need us, and we will always welcome you home. Congratulations, class of 2021. And now we would like to introduce the MSU College of Arts and Letters degree candidates in alphabetical order.
Will the candidates please stand? On behalf of Michigan State University President Samuel L. Stanley Jr., MD, who has been delegated the authority of the state of Michigan vested in the Board of Trustees, I confer upon all of you the degrees for which you have been recommended with all the rights and distinctions to which they entitle you. According to custom, you may now move your tassels from the right side of your caps to the left. This act represents a great achievement and marks the beginning of a lifetime of dedicated service to the world. Today, we celebrate and recognize all of you who have completed an academic program in the College of Arts and Letters. And finally, we gratefully pay tribute to other individuals who have contributed their love, their understanding, their support, and their resources to help make this celebration possible. I refer to the good friends, family members, parents, grandparents, spouses, partners, children, siblings, and our world-class MSU faculty and staff. Thank you all. Once again, Congratulations, MSU alumni. Welcome to the Spartan family. We shall conclude this ceremony by standing to sing the MSU fight song. Go green!